Hey there, and welcome to the screencast about how to uh, create a works cited page uh, using the Noodle Tools platform that we have here at North. Um, so let me just make my head a little bit smaller here and I'll move it to the side. So I wanna bring up like what an actual works cited page looks like. Um, and this is what it looks like. So it'll say works cited at the top. Um, it will have all the sources used in whatever research project you're doing. Um, sources being like the citations really being like the author's name, the title of the article, um, when it was written, even the day you accessed it, and also the link. Um, so all of these different things um, compiled in one sort of a page that will really be the last piece of your research project. And it contains everything that you used in the project. Um, all the sources, not that you visited, but all the sources that you ultimately ended up citing from or creating note cards from that make it into your final project. So uh, this is what the end product's gonna look like, but let me show you how to really do it in Noodle Tools. Um, let me make myself a little bit smaller there, there we go. Um, so Noodle Tools does pretty much all of this work for you. So right now I have a project um, where I have a ton of different uh, sources in here. I have three different sources from the databases uh, that are in here. I've been doing this as I've been going along. You can see I have note cards already. I have previous videos that kind of go into those if you need to see that for the first time or as a refresher. Um, but because I've been doing the whole project in here, everything is really, really easy. Um, to generate a works cited page, all I have to do is go up here to this print export button. And when I click it, I'll have this drop down menu here. There's a lot of things on here. You can pretty much ignore everything except for this print slash export to Word. And when I click that, it's gonna ask me, you know, what kind of sources I have. I always leave it on all sources. It's really the best way just to make sure everything comes out nicely. Uh, and I click submit. Now, once you do that, Noodle Tools behind the scenes is going to generate this page in a Microsoft Word document. Um, and this is it right here. So I can take this page, I can save it to my OneDrive. Um, I could also download a local file so that I'll do that right now. It'll go to my actual computer and I can open it up. Um, and it's this right here. Let's see, there we go. So that's that. This is what a works cited page is. This is what it looks like. Um, and this is how you would do it in Noodle Tools. So if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out either in email or in Teams or just stop by the library to, um, to, you know, to talk to me. All right, take care.